Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's Mars, bro. Back at it again with another unboxing video. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I totally just went there. And uh, so guys, um, let's get started. Uh, the reason I got this uh, particular product uh, was because um, I've never actually seen uh, an unboxing video on this one yet, or, or review even. And I mean, there's not really much to review here. Anything else in the package? Nah, nothing. Off to the side. Um, but uh, definitely something that's been around for uh, quite some time, and I guess the most, one of the more legal friendly products, and that is the Balio by uh, Spider Co. And a uh, Fisher Pen, Fisher Space Pen, I believe, or something like that, is the one they were working with. Look at that, it's already kind of open. What's up? Who's playing with my Balio? Alright guys, let's uh, jump right into it. You can already pretty much see it. This is the Balio Wing. I'm sorry, I didn't even finish saying it. So I'm gonna put that aside real quick. Let's check what else is inside this. Uh, we got the little box, uh, looks like some basic instructions and some uh, contact information. Some basic openings. Quite a few basic openings. If you guys don't already know how to do this, put that away. So guys, here it is. Let's check it out. We got the Balio Wing here. Um, it's, you know, just, it, it was only like seven bucks. I was like, you know what, I'm gonna just, I've never handled one, I've never used one, and I can't say anything about it or else, you know, I'm just being ignorant. So this is the latest variation of the Balio. Um, obviously with these, uh, little wings here. It helps out with stability, it helps out with durability and ergonomics. And oh my god, there is so much play on this. It's just bugging me. Look at that. It's like the first thing I noticed when I pulled it out. I don't know if I can tighten it. I'll probably try to tighten it later. We got some torque screw bits in here. We're rocking just some stainless steel uh, pivots there. Pretty much it. Um, so what these extra wide handles do, the longitudinal uh, slots make the Balio easier to handle and manipulate. So that's pretty exciting. I've never, you know, again, never used the other one, so I'm not going to really know the difference. But I thought I'd get the latest one to check that one out. Alright guys, so uh, let's, let's do that first opening by the way. I'm kind of curious how it's going to be. It's pretty small. <laughs> it's got a little noise, that's cool. So yeah guys, let's talk uh, some quick specs on this little guy right here. Um, so we're looking at uh, 4.25 inches, 4.25 inches in a uh, closed length. Um, I didn't get the exact measurement for uh, overall length, but we're looking about seven and a half, around there. Right around seven and a half inches overall length. Um, this is uh, all made from polymer. This is all polymer. This is, we got blue handles all. It's all made from that hard plastic. It's a uh, nice durable. You can kind of bend it if you squeeze hard enough, but you know, it's, 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 it's durable. You know, it's a little, you know, probably not gonna, anyways, it's, it's only seven bucks, so it's not bad. Um, the weight we're looking at 0.93 ounces. So, very light, probably the lightest one I have, and the smallest one that I've ever had. I was planning on getting the 51, and I thought that was going to be the one, but I guess this tops it by a landslide. Um, uh, we're looking at, unfortunately, um, the one that I came with, well I guess it's not really a bad thing, the ink color is blue. And um, the way that works is just a little twist, you just twist it out, comes right out. So yeah, you just, you know... And then we got these clips right here, these clips which are actually removable. There is no latch to hold it together, but I mean if you clip them together, I really doubt it's going to be opening up in your pants like that. So this does use a Fisher Space Pen, um, so I guess that's how you know it's a heavy duty, but it was only, uh, I don't know, anyways. Um, which it can write underwater in the freezing cold, boiling heat. Um, any angle, even upside down, so I guess that's a uh, very nice. Um, the other lightweight values just have regular replaceable ink cartridges, so I don't know why they don't all come with it. Maybe they all do now, I really have no idea, but I just got the other wing, so that one does come with it. 
Anyways, moving on, um, uh, that's actually pretty much it. I don't know what else to say. All right, so this is what's throwing me off. I'm really trying to figure out if this is considered a lightweight or a heavyweight. They say that heavyweight uses brass weights at the bottom, which this one does not. The heavyweight uses a Fisher Space Pen, which this one does. And the, well, I tried looking for the weight on the heavyweight, but apparently, I, I couldn't find it anywhere. It was like, I, I believe it's .85, I'm not even sure. But this one actually weighs out at .93 ounces. Um, so it just, I'm like, what? So in the lightweights use stainless steel weights, which this does, but they don't have those Fisher Space Pens, so I'm like, I don't know, I don't know. But the other thing that the heavy duty one has is a higher price tag, which this one does not. So, and it is the newest variation, so I was like, wow, why not, why not just get this one? Like, forget the heavy duty one. But who knows, I've never handled a heavy duty, I wonder really a big difference. I believe it's also polymer. Don't quote me on that. Comment down below if I'm wrong. So again, yeah, no latch on this one. The play is ridiculous, but I mean, this isn't supposed to be a high-end flipper or anything. Let's check out that tap. <laughs> I actually don't even hear anything, just because it's all soft. Soft. Um, but I might mess with these uh, torque screws here. Might tighten it, see what happens, because this is play is driving me crazy it's like my OCD kicking in <sighs> so um, there's no way to signify a bite side a bite handle or anything but I mean again this is not supposed to well I would totally suggest flipping a squiddy over this thing if you really want to get into the hobby um, but uh, totally legal you could take it anywhere um, I do advise though or be careful um, be cautious because with today's day and age Things are a little crazy nowadays, so be careful out there, you guys. And um, let's all be safe here. Uh, this is not the most exciting thing um, I have bought, but I just really wanted to try it out. It's really only $7 if you want to try it out, and you can write with it. It's actually kind of grippy. You can hold it like this, just mm, boom, boom, done. Put it back in your pocket. Boom! Let's go. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for my video. Like the video if you guys liked it, uh, comment down below if uh, you guys have any uh, suggestions or something else I should check out. But anyways guys, um, thanks for watching uh, and I'll uh, catch you guys on my next video. Peace.